What's up, y'all? Bring you guys another video. So, just bring you guys the latest when it comes to the fight between Teofimo Lopez and George Cambosos Jr. As you guys can tell by the title, the fight is finally official again. It's been official way back when it was supposed to happen back in June, then it was supposed to happen back in August, and now it's finally happening in October. Now, before I get more into the video, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more boxing and please hit that like button. It helps out the video. It helps out the channel. I'd really appreciate it. So, um, yeah, uh, October 4. October 4 is the date. Originally, they were talking about October 5, but now it's October 4, 2021. According to Mike Kovinger, who now writes for ESPN, he uh, recently tweeted out saying, and I quote, he said, Tifimo Lopez George Cambosos is now officially set for Monday, October 4, at New York's Hulu Theater at Madison Square Garden. Both fighters have signed the contracts, Triller COO Torstein Mayer tells ESPN. Triller is marked to avoid possibility of Yankees Red Sox playoff game on October 5 in New York. So, um, yeah, like I was saying, October 5 was the original date they were talking about for this fight, which is a Tuesday. And um, like Copinger said, there's going to be a, uh, a baseball game that day in New York. So I guess they're trying to avoid that. And uh, now instead, it's going to be on a uh, Monday, which is very unusual. Very, very unusual. Usually, it's a weekend. You know, Saturday, Sunday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Um, but now we have Monday. Monday, man. It should have just gone with Tuesday, in my opinion, because if it was a Tuesday, I would definitely be buying, buying this fight. But since it's on a Monday, I'll be at work. But, you know, it is what it is. Um, Yeah, I wonder what the undercard will look like. That's what I'm wondering. Um, I don't know, man. This fight should just has happened back in June. If you remember, the only reason why they postponed it back in June, early June to late June, is because they didn't want to go... Uh, against or they didn't want to compete with the Mayweather event uh, that Sunday back in early June and this fight was scheduled on the Saturday and they had no competition that day no competition no no fights going on that day but they decided to spawn it I don't know why stupid move and um, you know now the fight is what four months late <sighs> frustrating man it's frustrating but hopefully it does happen. Both fighters are forced to get vaccinated. Um, if you guys didn't know, uh, Triller is making them vaccinate. So, yeah, honestly, at this point, I don't know why. I mean, I know a lot of people believe that the vaccine is this and that. But at this point, if the vaccine helps you from getting not getting sick, I mean, I know you still can get sick. But it definitely decreases your chances of getting sick. Might as well just do it to avoid getting sick. So that you can get paid big money instead of getting postponed and possibly not fighting. It's a good thing these these two are still fighting because if I remember correctly, there were some talks about it not happening. But obviously, Trailer has already put in invested a lot of money into this. <laughs> They're losing a hell of a lot of money, that's for sure. Um, but yeah, I'll be watching. I'll be I'll be watching. Oh, I have work. That's right, because it's, it's a Monday. Let me know your thoughts. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And like always, have a great day. Alright, thanks.